talking about that real life Holding on cause it just feels nice But let's get back to real life Real life Talking about that real life Holding on cause it just feels nice But let's get back to real Today's a fresh start for me quite literally as I kick off my day with some refreshing orange juice courtesy to Nama Wells' new citrus attachment. Let me tell you, it's definitely worth having. But before I dive into the joys of juicing, let me share a bit about what's been going on in my world. Recently, I've been on a journey to prioritize my mental health, especially after a rough encounter that landed me in the ER. It turns out what I thought were heart problems were actually severe panic attacks. Stress has been building up for a while now, and my body finally decided to hit the brakes. Imagine this, moving day to a new place and bam, panic attack central. The timing was so off, the stress of possibly delaying my move out date was just a cherry on top. It's been a whirlwind to say the least, and that's part of why I've been MIA on our Sunday calls. I've always worn many hats, always ready to lend a helping hand to others, but being an empath, I've realized that sometimes I forget to take care of myself in the process. Today, I'm choosing to change that narrative. Alongside my tasty orange juice, I'm loading up on all the good stuff. Cabbage, lemon, ginger, apples, berries, you name it, all packed with love and goodness for my body and mind. It's all about living a bit softer, putting myself first for once. I strongly encourage you to do the same if you ever find that you're spreading yourself thin. Also, all of these tasty recipes will be included in the description for your reference. Let me tell you about this new recipe I stumbled upon that's now my absolute everyday must have juice, strawberries and apples. Now here's the thing, I didn't plan this out meticulously, I just raided the fridge and decided to throw together whatever I found. And this is it for me, it turned out to be a winner. This juice is refreshing and it has a refreshing breeze that just hits the spot. Now I know that sometimes you feel like juicing is a full time job, but trust me on this, give this juice recipe a try and it might just change your mind. It's that good. And if you're loving this fancy glass to go cup I'm flying, I included the link so that you can get yours too. I snagged it from Amazon and let me tell you, it's not your flimsy, fragile glass. It's thick and sturdy, just the way I like it. Speaking of being on the move, I also whipped up some honeydew juice for my to-go bag because I'm still all about that juice life, even when I'm out and about. You never know when you're going to make it back home, so I keep juice close. To all of you trying out my daily recipes I post on my community tab, have, I hope they've been hitting the spot for you. And even though this cleanse has been quite the roller coaster ride for me, I wouldn't trade it for the world. Can you believe that we're almost halfway through this cleanse? Time truly flies when you're not focused on what day you're on. It's all about carrying on as if it's a lifestyle because it is temporarily. I'm telling you that there ain't no other way. Pack your bags and then you will go away. I'm not gonna be begging you to stay. Me yesterday, I would handle this shit differently. Things are different, I'm a new way. That's not gonna happen. That's not gonna happen. That's not, that's not gonna happen. So, even if you're asking, even, even if you're asking. 
Can I just take a moment to appreciate how amazing the weather is today? Seriously, it was like Mother Nature gifted me with sunshine. I don't know about you, but I just have to get out the house at least once a day to get some fresh air. My daughter and I decided to head out for some quality time together. There is something special about just being with her. You know, we love hanging out and creating content together, capturing those moments of love and pure intentions. Because to be honest, time has a sneaky way of stealing memories, but those captured moments there forever amidst all of the fun I still have some real work to do with myself after that trip to the ER and the doctor's reassuring words about my physical health being great it sounds like a moment of celebration but it is hard for me turns out my mental state has been spilling over into my physical well-being so it's a wake-up call for me so I'm on a mission to take care of both my mind and my body. And hey, if you're on a similar journey, know that you're not alone. Let's use the power of the juice and heal ourselves from the inside out. Better days are coming. Where you been and where you hiding? I know you're lying. Don't you try it, no. You really shouldn't play with fire. Put it out with water, but now you're drowning There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying Whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you But I don't wanna be like you I am exhausted from being at the laundromat. I usually wash all my mattress covers and comfort sets at the laundromat because the process is quicker. Anywho, I'm diving into my herbs right now. I haven't had any greens today, so I'm going in with my lemon, cilantro, and blackberries. Believe it or not, blackberries add a lot of flavor when juiced. It's also a diabetic friendly ingredient for those looking to try this recipe. Now, although I use lemon among other things to clean my leafy greens, I always go in with my organic fruit and veggie spray from Sprouts. It just works for me and I love it. I also believe it's a great way to clean your fruit and veggies if you're a beginner juicer. It's all about making things simple. Once I'm done with all of this, I have to bottle up all my juices for tomorrow and clean all my bottles. This part of it can be nerve wracking. I always juice more than what I need just so it lasts throughout the next day. I'm always trying to be two steps ahead in case something unexpected happens. Again. But let's chat about why it's important to mix things up when it comes to your juice recipes. Sticking to the same old ingredients might seem easy, but trust me, your body craves variety. And here's why. First off, different ingredients bring different nutrients to the table. By incorporating a diverse range of fruits, veggies, and even herbs into your juices, you're ensuring that your body gets a wide array of vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. It's like giving your system a VIP pass to a nutrition party. But wait, there's more. Mixing up your ingredients keep things interesting. Let's face it, drinking the same juice day in and day out, unless it's your favorite, can get pretty boring. By experimenting with different combinations, you're keeping your taste buds happy and your palate satisfied. Plus, let's not forget about the power of synergy. When you mix and match ingredients, you're creating a symphony of flavor that works together to support your body's natural detoxification processes. It's like giving your cleanse a turbo boost. So whether you're throwing in some leafy greens, adding in a splash of citrus, or getting adventurous with your herbs and spices, remember a variety is key to maximizing your cleansing experience. Trees are in green, the ocean is gray, sky is a vague blue, come my way. My room is a mess, it could use a hand, my favorite TV shows are capturing. I know I must get it right, I must get back in the fight, this can't be a surprise. I think I'll let it slide. Every now and again, I opt for something completely different. Sweet potatoes with nut milk is just a different juicing experience. I used to use nuts like almonds or cashews, but found that pecans are the best to be paired with sweet potatoes. I soak my dates for five to seven minutes and I use it to make my pecan milk. Most people juice all of these ingredients together, but I wanted to juice it separately this time around. I decided to make my nut milk first, then my sweet potato juice and pour them together in a glass. I did it this way because I have so 
so many ideas with pecan milk that I wanted to make sure I had some left over. All my juices today turned out delicious. Thank you so much for watching my journey. I truly appreciate it and I cannot wait to share more with you. I've been hanging on counting days thinking it was me all along. Had a million conversations in my head about where it went wrong. And I've got no idea where you've been, who you are, not anymore All I got is this Polaroid picture of us from June 24th It's where I kissed you for the first time, played on your sheets You gave me your heart and said you trusted with me But all I did was let you down time and time again It wasn't my intention